Today we're gonna be talking about 10 guns pro players never use in this thing called Call of Duty Zombies and it doesn't mean they are good or worse weapons, they can be used whenever you don't have any ammo left or you can just use them to make points but pro players and Carlos will never use it because they know it ain't that swell. Now take a guess, drop one weapon name in the comments that you think pro players never use and also if you're new to the channel hey make sure to subscribe and let me know in the comments so I can feature you in my next video but Coming in at our number 10 spot, we're talking about this thing called Cav 40. Now, let's say if I was making a video where I had a title like 10 guns everyone forgot in the history of Call of Duty, it doesn't matter, right? It doesn't matter. If I was making a video like 10 guns people forgot, this should have been the number one because I don't hear anyone say this, like even Bob, right? Bob's crazy, you already know, I don't even have to say shit. Even Bob forgot the Cav 40. Now, Cav 40 is an automatic pistol, if you know what I'm saying. It has very low damage, very low amount of ammo. The only thing I would say is that it has very high mobility and it's very easy to train with but it's just crazy as soon as you pull that trigger shit goes shit's crazy and it's not really a good meme the only thing I'm gonna say if cap 40 was in black ops 3 and if this was a wall gun and if it has twice the ammo than it currently has and if you could slap that good good dead wire on it shit would be crazy you already know what I'm saying but coming in at our number nine spot we're talking about this thing called the chicken now a lot of people say that whenever you got chicken Papa bless you because the mobility this thing has it's straight up fire, right? Every time Bob see you use this, he wanna use this. But guess what? Carlos got game. As soon as he see you use a chicken, he'll be like, bro, just like stop it. Uh, I got the Apothecan Servant. Take my Apothecan Servant, but don't do this to yourself. You can be using the chicken. Carlos is a kind hearted person. He cannot see anyone use the chicken. Now, chicken has very good mobility. It's so easy to train, but the only reason is that it's in Black Ops 2 Zombies and it's a burst weapon. A lot of people hate burst weapons, but if this thing was in Black Ops 3 and if you slap that dead wire, it's so trash that it would have activated that dead wire and that dead wire would have cleared the whole horde of zombies if you know what I mean but the only good thing Chickum has it's basically it's mobility and the amount of ammo it got it's very limited but at the same time you cannot go wrong if you're thinking about making points but coming in at our number 8 spot we're talking about the noobs friendly weapon the SVG itself now every time Bob see this gun coming out from the mystery box he goes crazy his mentality is basically like if he's gonna use like long ass weapons it's gonna kill zombies it's gonna melt zombies and trust me, Bob's crazy. I'm, I'm pretty sure like if you actually stuck around and you watch like 10 things noobs do part 3 You already know like how crazy Bob is now check this out as soon as Carlos finds out that Bob is gonna use SVG He will try everything he can like he will make sure that he will give like the thunder gun to Bob He will make sure that Bob is using something good right and he will try to explain why the SVG isn't that good He will say well number one it hasn't like got any good mobility. It doesn't have a lot of ammo It's a sniper rifle basically he will explain basically he will try to explain the best as he possibly can to Bob but of course Bob is Bob Bob's crazy he will just like uh, shut up Carlos you know what I'm saying and guess what Carlos will be triggered like any other human being on this planet called Earth right like Carlos will be triggered and guess what he gonna do next he will actually go he will quit his game very politely very sort of like uh, uh, he will go easy on himself but he will be triggered that's what I'm trying to say he will go easy uh, he will just close his application and guess what seconds later black ops 3 wouldn't be on his ps4 but coming in at our number seven spot we're talking about the barrett 50 cal now barrett has 50 cal uh ammo or rounds in that barrett if you know what i'm saying and shit blows my mind every time i like hear barrett 50 cal i'm just like this is gonna like melt all the zombies right of course it was like super super good in the multiplayer if you know what i mean like you can just quick scope for days on end doesn't matter doesn't matter doesn't require any skill you can just like go quick scope L1, L2 or R1, R2, whatever, it doesn't matter, right? You can have alternative controller and shit like that, but we're talking about this thing called Call of Duty Zombies. Now, Barrett 50 Cal, all right? Every time pro players see this coming out from the mystery box, they low-key get triggered inside because they know how bad this mother effer is, right? Barrett 50 Cal, it doesn't even have a lot of bullets to begin with, and shit's crazy. I don't even have to, like, I don't want to, like, beat a dead horse at this point. All I'm gonna say, Barrett 50 Cal 
it's a good meme. But coming in at our number six spot, we're talking about the damn Olympia. Now, Olympia is crazy. It's noobs friendly weapon once again, but I'm gonna say, guys, don't do the Olympia. Uh, do the M14, but don't do the Olympia. May the papa be on your side, but hey, what I'm trying to say, Olympia is crazy. Bob's crazy with it. Every time Bob uses it, he, he feels like he's like in a happy land and he's just trying to kill zombies and he thinks to himself that with Olympia, I can get you around 100. Not in Black Ops 3 zombies, but in Black Ops 2. And if you're a professional zombie player out there, if you're listening, you know how hard it is to get you around 100 in Black Ops 2 zombies. Black Ops 2 zombies is crazy, crazy hard. But Bob doesn't get this. Bob is like, it's the Olympia and you guys can cheat. He will pay like 500. He will feel like he's freaking walking on the moon like Neil Armstrong. But Carlos got game. He will never use this. First of all, Olympia has two bullets in the chamber. And every time you shoot this thing, you gotta reload, man. Like, even if you pack a bunch of shit, it, it, it ain't that small. Now, all I gotta say is that if I was making a video about, like, 10 worst guns in the history of Call of Duty Zombies, this should have been number one. Or maybe not number one, but let's say, like, top five, right? Let, let's be real. But coming in at our number five spot, we're talking about the S12. Now, first of all, I'm pretty sure some people will be triggered. You will be like, yo, Skittle, you don't even know what the hell you're talking about. Hear me out. That's all I'm gonna say. Bob's crazy. But even Bob, Bob's gonna be like, S12, nah, get out of here. Like, even Bob's gonna say that. But the thing is, S12 is crazy good in terms of damage. I would say it's Haymaker 2.0, but it doesn't have a lot of ammo. Even when you pass it, it doesn't have a lot of ammo and that's the whole downside about the S12. It doesn't have ammo and it cannot compete with all the other guns that we currently have in Black Ops 2 Zombies and believe me, pro players, as soon as they get that, they will use it, they will be like, okay, it was a good meme, uh, I'ma just like trade this thing. But coming in at our number 4 spot, we're talking about the War Machine. Now, let the memes begin. Now, War Machine, shit's crazy. Now, the thing is, when you use this unpack, all you're gonna do is you're gonna pull the trigger and you're gonna shoot those grenades, right? But as soon as you pack punch it, it becomes like the channel like but on steroids, if you know what I mean, right? But uh, War Machine can easily get you down. If you want to go down, if you want to be like, if you want to troll Bob, like, let's say Carlos is a kind-hearted person, let's find Alejandro, right? Like, Alejandro is crazy, and guys, in my 10 things or 10 things to do to annoy randoms, Alejandro is gonna be the guy, right? I'm revealing his name right now. It's exclusive shit, goddamn. But Alejandro will be the only guy that will say that War Machine is a good meme to Bob. And Bob's like crazy, right? Bob's gonna use it without even having a second thought. He will be like, okay, it explodes, mamacita, I will use it. This is the best thing ever in zombies. Uh, I can get you round 1000 right now. But coming in at our number three spot, now we're talking about the Gorgon. Now, Gorgon, a lot of people say it's the best gun right like it's the best gun of course like a lot of guns can be good with dead wire in black ops 3 and even with blast furnace and uh, gorgon has damage i'll say that for sure like it's very good if you want to use it on the catwalk in the giant then it's very good but hey you got alternative like you can use the dredge even their dredge it's very good like it's a six shot burst weapon it's very effective i, I would say use the dredge over gorgon but hey the thing is like lmg slows you down quite a lot in this thing called black ops 3 zombies and the thing is when you're using a gun that has very low amount of firing rate and that's the LMG and that is in Black Ops 3 zombies shit gonna slow you down quite a lot and on high round it's not really a good meme but let's say you have a uh, slab dead wire or blast furnace on this B I would say like slab blast furnace because you know blast furnace only activates here and there so you wouldn't have to shoot a lot if you know what I mean and the more you shoot it's gonna increase that probability of you going down if you know what I mean right it can be good if you know how to use it but pro players never use this thing unless they are playing the giant but hey you got other options like I said BRM dingo and the dredge but coming in at our number two spot we're talking about the XM 50 Three. And as soon as Bob see the name, like, XM53, he's like, it's the 8th wonder of this uh, planet called Earth, right? Like, as soon as he see, like, the size of the XM53, and XM53 is huge. Don't take my words in a wrong direction, like, that's not what I'm trying to say. But as soon as he see XM53, and as soon as he reads the name, Bob's gonna go crazy. He'll be like, this is the best thing ever that happened to me, right? He will, like, use it, and guess what? Seconds later, he will go down, but he won't blame... 
XM53, he will say, okay, well, uh, connection got interrupted, as you guys can see, but he will never blame himself. That's very important to him. Like, he doesn't worry, he doesn't care, he doesn't give a damn. As soon as he goes down, he will blame lag. That's all he's gonna do. He's not even gonna blame the XM53 because he knows XM53 explodes. It has 53 in the name and it's a huge ass weapon, right? He will never blame the XM53, but guess what? Carlos is gonna see him use this thing and Carlos is a kind-hearted person, right? He will let him use the Apothecan Servant, but guess what? Bob's crazy, he'll be like, no, I cannot trade my XM53 and uh, guess what? Carlos is gonna leave the game, like, I know Carlos is a kind-hearted person, but he will leave the game because he will be insanely triggered. Carlos never gets triggered, but this time he will be triggered. But do you wanna know what grind Carlos gears? Surprise, surprise, XM53. But coming in at our number one spot, now we're talking about a meme gun and that is the SMR. Now I guess that's it for the video. Check out some other videos on the screen. Subscribe if you happen to be new but honestly SMR it's like when you double pap it I guess I'm gonna leave it for the next video. I'm not gonna say what it does or anything like that but SMR is a semi-auto weapon and it doesn't kill any zombie even if you pap it and guys it's a good meme.